Hello everyone and welcome to our lesson for today. For today's lesson, we will be focusing on rhyme time. So let's get started. Materials. All you need for our lesson today is just your thinking cap. So let's get our brains ready. There are two learning targets for our lesson today. The first target says, I can identify the name and sound for the letters A, T, H, P, N, C, M, R, S, V, G, I, D, F, L, K, Y, Q, U, and X. And our second target says, I can identify and produce words that rhyme. Sounds. Let's practice all of the letters that we've learned so far with our letter sound chant. I want you to repeat them after me. We'll start with the letter A. Ready? A, A, alligator. T, T, turn. H, H, house. P, P, parrot. N, N, newt. C, K, cat. M, M, mountain. R, R, rabbit. S, S, snake. V, V, vulture. G, G, goose. I, I, iguana. D, D, dog. F, F, flamingo. L, L, lion. K, K, kangaroo. Y, Y, yak. Q, Qu, Quail. U, a umbrella. X, X, fox. Nice job with your letter sound chant. Transition song. Now it's time to sing with me. Now it's rhyme time, now it's rhyme time. Hear the sounds, hear the sounds. Listen for the pattern, listen for the pattern. At the end, at the end. Sounds. We're going to do some exploring of some sounds today. But before we do that, let's play a little game. I'm going to say a word and then show you two objects. You'll say the name of the objects and then we'll figure out how they go together. All right, here are my first two words and I want you to say them after me. Rose, nose. How do these two words go together? You're right, they rhyme. They sound the same. They have the same ending sound. What sound do you hear that's the same? Yes, they both have the O's sound at the end. Rose, nose. Nice job. Here's my next one. Rope, slope. How do these two words go together? Yes, they rhyme. What sound do you hear at the end that's the same? 
Yes, they both have the ope sound at the end. Rope, slope. Yes, you're right. Nice job with my rhyming words. Read aloud. Our poem, A Fox and a Quail in the Rain, has some rhyming words too. Let's listen and see if we can find them. A fox on a box and a quiet little quail sat under an umbrella in the rain. It was a quarter to six. They were in quite a fix. The water, it was rising so quick. They climbed up a big tree and who did they see? A queen with a bright golden crown. So together they sat and had a long chat and waited until the water went down. Did you hear any rhyming words in our poem? Yes, I did too. I'm going to read the poem again. And this time, if you hear any rhyming words, I want you to stand up and jump. Are you ready to move? All right, remember to stand up and jump anytime you hear a rhyming word. Here we go. A fox on a box and a quiet little quail sat under an umbrella in the rain. It was a quarter to six. They were in quite a fix. The water, it was rising so quick. They climbed up a big tree and who did they see? a queen with a bright golden crown. So together they sat and had a long chat and waited until the water went down. Nice job jumping at all of the rhyming words. Closing reflection. How do we know that crown and down are rhyming words. Yes, they have the same rhyming sound at the end. How might knowing rhyming words help us with reading and writing? Nice job thinking. Great job rhyming. Listen for words around you today that sound the same at the end. Thanks for joining me again today and helping find all of our rhyming words. I hope you had fun and I will see you next time. Bye.